This is my tiny. My desk is like, when I sit at it, I am away from the window and I apologize, but I don't really have another place to do this more um, efficiently and carefully. I don't even have a place to put my phone, you guys. I've never done this before. Um, I had a rough night last night. My stomach was upset last night, and I also couldn't sleep because of barking dogs. So that's why my appearance is not as managed as it normally would be. I'm running on like a few hours of sleep. But nonetheless, I'm really excited for today. I need more room. My mom looked and she said she doesn't think we have any clear ones. Hi, Holly. She got these. That's perfect. Uh, that bigger one especially. Oh, okay. That was her suggestion. This is going to be our catch cup. <laughs> when I picked this up, the FedEx lady was kind of freaked out that she had to touch this box by the look on her face, so. Um. FedEx lady, I'm sorry. Are you going to be here for moral support, Holly? Yeah. I'm not going to miss this. Do you want to record with your phone up close to the spiders so that I can also show them like another point of view? That would be cool. Um, yeah, let me just make sure. All right, we got the first lid open. Oh, my heart is jumping. I've never done this. Okay, so there's a fear not business card. All right, your spiderlings are secure inside tightly closed vials. The vials are wrapped up in newspaper and colored tissue paper to help absorb bumps during shipping. Lightly spray droplets of water on the sides of the habitat so the spiderling will have immediate access to water. It is a good idea to house spiderlings over a large bowl in case one decides to bolt. Some people choose to do this in a bathtub. <sighs> Slowly unwrap electrical tape. There's a plug made of tissue under the lid. Remove the paper plug to expose the spiderling. The spiderling is inside a tube that you should be able to gently pull out of the vial. As you pull the vial out of the tube, if the tube starts to twist or it does not come out, immediately stop because you'd be hurting the spiderling if the tissue inside is twisting. Once the tube is out, you can slowly unwrap it or you can just set the tube inside the inside the habitat. Spiderlings will often come out on their own as you unwrap the tube or as soon as you remove the plug from the vial after opening it. If a spiderling gets on your hand, do not be alarmed. It is very unlikely to bite and even if it does, you will likely not feel it if it is small. We tell you this because if you suddenly pull back and are afraid of it, you could injure the spiderling. Spiderlings oftentimes appear smaller than what you might think because they are usually scrunched up until they are comfortable. Okay. Oh, I'm not going to do this in a bathtub. <laughs> There's a small child here, so. This is all I see right now in the box. Oh my gosh, I already see a vial with holes in it. My heart is beating. I'm really scared. Oh, I think this is... Did they already put everything in it for me? I thought I was going to set this up myself, in all honesty. Well, he's definitely... Not in here. They wouldn't ship them like that. I don't think he's in this tissue. He, she, I don't know what it is. Ooh, and I have a lanyard that says Fear Not Tarantulas. Cool. I also got some tweezers for a uh, small prey, like for like uh, bugs and stuff for feeding them. Oh, I'm really nervous. Ugh. Oh, I think he's in here. Whew. 
Oh. Way tinier than I expected. I don't even think I can see him in here. And he's not wrapped in tissue paper. He's so... Oh my gosh. Come look at how tiny this is. I can't even find him in here. He's not even wrapped in tissue paper like I thought. And my little enclosure that they gave me is already set up for me. Oh. I can't even see him in here. They haven't opened it? Huh? They haven't opened it? <laughs> not yet. I'm scared. These are the directions, right? Yes. And it says... It's a good idea to have spiderlings in a large bowl in case one decides to bolt. Some people choose to do this in a bathtub. So, there's that. But he's so, he's so small. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna... I got it. I just don't want the substrate to go everywhere. Sorry, I was interested in the smell of dirt. I'm nervous. Okay, so I guess let's open him, right? You want to record? I'm nervous to do this. I'm scared that once I take off this electrical tape that like, <laughs> the one's going to like them. pop off. I'm a little shaky because I'm nervous. I can't see him. He's on the lid. Mm -hmm. Oh, if he's on the lid, I'm going to scream. I'm, I'm scared he's going to be on the top of the freaking lid. I'm getting nervous. Okay. Why don't you have the cup ready? Here. Can I do this? Oh, I'm just having a courage issue. Oh, Ooh, I'm scared. Well, he's in there somewhere. Mm. Okay. I think I see him. Do you, do you see him? It's so dark, but he's burrowed in there. If you say so. Oh, I see him. He's at the very bottom. Just take it easy and you can... You see him? No. You see him in there? Yeah, he's in there. Oh, there he is. There he is. <laughs> see him? <sighs> now I want to get him out. What if? Hold Excuse on. me. Thinking about just leaving it in there. And see if he climbs out of it. <laughs> I mean, do you want to do that? He's so small. I'm so scared of him, but he's so cute. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I believe in you. I believe in you. I can see him. <laughs> I can't see it either. It's hard. Come on. Come on. What if he, he doesn't know? Come on. Come on. What, oh. what if you were to put him into this cup, right? Like put the vial in sideways in here. Well, hold on. This is working. Okay. Oh, Action. he has moved more yeah. than I thought. Holy shit. Yeah. Okay. No! <laughs> oh, my progress. <laughs> he said no, nah, fast. Just don't bolt. I'm not ready for that. You got this guy. Come on. I believe in you. What's gonna work? Yes. 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 Perfect. Okay. Just a little more. Come on, guy. Come on. Get off of there. Okay, I'm gonna turn this. <gasps> Did you get on? Did I do it? Come on, guy. <gasps> it's 
first successful rehouse. <laughs> it took way longer than it should have, but I did it. <laughs> well, you did it. I'm proud of you. It took longer than it should have, but I let my nerves kind of get to me. <laughs> It's not perfect, but just for now. <laughs> I am a real tarantula pet owner now. I am so happy. <gasps> oh my gosh, you're so pretty! All right, well, that is my first little spiderling in rehousing. It's really hard to see him, but he is just chilling like a villain underneath this leaf right here. I'll try and take pictures of him in some better videos if um, he's sitting out more, but there's a good chance he'll burrow, so we'll see. <laughs>